So today I want to make my little dog a crochet hat. I One thing that's really popular in like the crochet side of the internet is um, bees. So um, bees are really, really popular. You know, you get your regular bees, you get strawberry bees, you get pumpkin spice bees, um, all these cool bees um, everywhere. And so I wanted to make my little dog a crochet bee hat. I think it would be really, really cute, especially for like summer and stuff. So I'm going to start that today. The yarn I'm going to be using, I'm pretty sure this is just from Hobbycraft, I think it's just DK yarn. I got it last year and it's just been sitting in my stash since, so I'm going to use it. I'm also going to be using a 3.5 millimeter hook. I haven't used this in so long. I've been working with um, six millimeter hooks for quite some time now, so the tea we have is just regular British tea. Um, English breakfast tea I think it's called and in this cute little Doberman cup is it a Doberman it's like a it's like a sausage dog um yeah so I have no idea how to do this I'm just gonna um, wing it and see how it goes <laughs> um, I should probably have the dog up here so I can like measure and stuff but she is bonkers at the minute I'm gonna be doing like a ribbing around the neck part um, just regular ribbing oh. this is the bad dog in question so yeah let's get started so I'm probably gonna chain to the length the size of her neck oh my god it's been so long since I used a small hook <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six. no no um no not using a small hook I refuse <laughs> I hate small hooks. <laughs> We're gonna use a six millimeter instead. Right, let's start again. So just starting with a slip knot, and then I will crochet to the length of her neck. So one, two, three, four, dog got kicked out um, while I ate some food I took a break um, I've only been gone for like 20 minutes it's nothing crazy but we have this much so far and we're gonna see if that will fit it does yay let me see let me see the best thing about using the rib stitch for <laughs> You are so neat. And this is our collar. You wanna come up and try it on? Sit. Good girl. Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. Is it cozy? Sit. Sit. I didn't ask you to lie down. I didn't ask you. I didn't ask you. Oh my god, but how cute does this look just by itself? This is adorable. Oh, you're so cute. But I changed from yellow to start with to black to start making our bee stitches. And this is what we've got so far. This is literally just two rows. I had originally done I had originally done 
four rows of yellow but I took all that out to do two rows of black instead so yeah let's continue I didn't finish finish it I still need to add like stuff to it but here is what we're working with how cute is that I don't really like the top I will insert I tried it on in the dog um I will insert like a little video of her wearing it but I don't like the top um and how it looks I'm hoping it'll look better once I put some like wings on it I'm gonna crochet those now and I still have the ends to weave in so this is it actually this is it and this is the side I was working on I'm not quite sure I like how I closed it up either I done slip stitches through the whole stitch I think I should have done like maybe the back looks looped only and as I said like I still have the ends to weave in but this is it um, and the top looks kind of okay, um, like that. But um, yeah, I think it's really cute. I don't. I'm not quite sure what happened here, um, to be quite honest. But yeah, let's crochet some wings. I've never done like wings before, so I'm probably gonna look up a tutorial on how to make bee wings. I'm sure there's probably one out there. And then um, I will attach those on. But I have this scrap yarn here from my Mrs. Claus hat that I am going to use. Um, just because I have it, I might as well use it sort of thing. Um, and I don't want to break into like a ball of white just for this project. Um, I might as well just use the scraps. You know, reduce, reuse, recycle. So... Yeah, I'm just gonna start the wings. Um, I'm gonna get a tutorial up, so I'll be right back. Got my two wings. So I think it's time to get the dog to see where we want these placed. And then we can stitch them on. I just finished it I just I finished the last ear I had to redo it because I ruined it and I attached it on this is what it looks like and let's try it on little miss dog that's why are you bullying me let me see you oh you're a cute bee you're a cute bee <laughs> You look so cute. Turn around here. Let the camera see. There you go. Wait, 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 wait. Let me see you. Wow. Wow. 